We start this journey at Grindley Brook Staircase Lock. There are six locks in total, but only three in the actual staircase. There are three locks before you get to the staircase lock. We then travel along the Langollen Canal, past the Whitchurch Marina, which has got quite a large higher fleet, before travelling possibly only two or three miles to a fantastic mooring spot just before the priest's arm. Nice. Next part of the journey, we're leaving Grindley Brook. We've been to the services. I've done some proper recycling in that I've reused our bin bag. Uh, some people will call it recycling, I just call it being tight fisted. So we're not quite sure where we're heading, but there's only two more locks left on the whole network. Uh, New Martin locks, but we won't be getting there today. We'll probably just go down as far as the priest branch, but we'll see. We're struggling to do any um, videoing. It's a bit, it's a bit busy just at these parts. We've just gone past the higher company of Whitchurch Marina, and uh, there were about 50 ye yellow Viking float boats all up, loaded suitcases, and they're all heading in this direction. So we're going to have some fun, and I've just had to move this camera. So I move it again because all the lift bridges they lift up on that side and the camera won't fit through. So Tom's just got off to go and lift the bridge for the chap in front of us. It's gonna be one of those days. It's all good fun. in a moaning old git. Don't know how to. <laughs> we need to, I think we need to like do some kind of like calming mindfulness session. Or hard drugs. Hard drugs? Yeah. It's beautiful Listen, down he, here. he can't even, he had, uh, the doctor prescribed him some, was it codeine phosphate? Codeine phosphate after an operation like that. <laughs> Are you seeing Clowns and made of wax melting in front of my face. <laughs> yeah, yeah, hallucinations. Did you enjoy that? No, no, I didn't enjoy it. No. no. Why anybody would want to take something that alters reality isn't totally beyond me. Depends on the reality. I wouldn't mind, but I wasn't in any pain before I took. Then why did you take pain meds? Because they told me to. You remember when I was in hospital and they forgot I was in that ward because I wasn't right, supposed right. to stay this is, in This overnight. is dead funny, right. So he's in a subsection to the ward and there's three rooms in, in that subsection. 
unfortunately, no one had told the night staff. Because I wasn't supposed to have been staying overnight. That, there, that he'd actually emergency to stay in. So it was about one o'clock in the morning when he hadn't had his anti blood clotting injection that's really urgent. And uh, they suddenly realised he was in the bed. No, somebody said, Is, is somebody in that room? Yeah, no, but well, you, ha you hadn't had your anti blood no, and then when I, at one o'clock in the morning when I pressed the buzzer and said, look, I, I don't mean to trouble you, but do I need this this injection or not? And she said, oh yeah, I'm ever so sorry, it's Mary, she's a brilliant nurse, but she's a bit forgetful. <laughs> not a brilliant nurse then, is she? It's all that one at the inquest. <laughs> to read to his grandkids so it's nice. Has he thought about a library? Anyway, we're nearly there. This is journey's end for today. It's not the best. Oh, it is actually. It's nice. There's a nature reserve across the other side. Let's see if we can see through the window. I don't know what they're reserving. But, uh, the journey will continue. 
حرف من بود سال.